Hello again and welcome to the allotment. I'm using this uh, headset today because I'm a bit worried about wind noise so hopefully this should reduce that. So I've been away for three weeks on holiday yeah so didn't get too much done in that time but this is my first day back and I've just dug a bed so here it is. There you go behind me. You can see it. It took me about three hours to dig this and just dug up the topsoil and uh, put it in a huge great pile over here which I'll show you now. This huge pile of soil is all of the topsoil from that bed. I don't know if you can see that. We've been digging this thing today. Uh, this has taken a long time. It takes a lot of work to dig out topsoil, I can tell you, just with a spade as well, not using any machines or anything. Um, but this is a two meter by four meter bed and we have, we've put um, logs around it, which were also available for free, luckily. Just before I left for holiday, I also made a path along the side of my allotment plot. And I made this just by digging out the topsoil. Um, <clears throat> and then I put down a fabric um, membrane, which is supposed to apparently stop weeds from growing through. And then I just put wood chip on top of that, which was luckily available. That was a plastic bag that's just on my tools from today. Um, yeah, so uh, put the wood chip on top of the fa fabric membrane. You can just see a bit of that poking out there. That's what it looks like. Yeah, so I think that looks pretty good. And I put some of these logs on the path just in case it was quite high winds just before I left on holiday. So the logs are to stop it from blowing away. I just thought, you know, the whole thing might just blow away, but it hasn't. So <laughs> that's positive. Um, yeah, I think it looks like a pretty neat little path. So if you have any ideas about what we should grow in our plot, I'd uh, love to hear in the comments and suggestions below. I'm a bit of a novice gardener, I have to admit, so I just want something easy to grow for our first plot and then maybe we'll get a bit more adventurous when we start planting the other ones. My camera cut out at that point so I didn't get to finish and say goodbye, but thanks for watching and I'll update you next time with an actual plan of how it all should look. See you next time.